questions, I'll take it. Like okay. Questions like five questions each guy. Armando, your thoughts? Yeah, you know, nobody talked about you guys coming in here. All the talk was Coach K. There was barely any mention about you guys, even though the rivalry is so big. And yet, I think people are probably talking about you a lot now, don't you think? Yeah, I mean, all year people have been questioning our toughness and just telling us what we can do. And I mean, coming into this game all week, we were confident that we would come in here and win. I mean, we knew they would come in fired up, but just all week, our main thing was we was going to win the fight or we was going to win the game, but someone was going to go down today. And luckily, we won the game. And I'm just so proud of the team. Coach Davis, he coached a great game. Everybody played hard, and it's definitely something to build on. Armando, go in. Excited. I mean, it was very emotional. Uh, me and Coach Davis were definitely very emotional just because all I've been through since I've been here and just to be able to get a signature win like this at a signature moment with Coach Davis and Coach K's court, it was just amazing. Armando, when you got that last dunk at the end to extend the lead to 10, uh, what was that moment like for you? What was going through your mind? Uh, I wasn't trying to lose. I mean, I was in this position my freshman year and we ended up losing, being up a huge lead at home. So, I mean, I wasn't excited until the buzzer ran off because you never can count them out. And I just, I did not want to go through that again. Armando, Armando, at what point did you know that you guys had, like, was there was there a point where you could kind of see maybe you would stood their run or something and you counter punch back and they, they may have been a little shook? Yeah, I mean, I would say just at the beginning of the game, just when we came out and threw that first punch and. I mean, I feel like we kind of stunned them, and it was just, I mean, we just came in confident. We believe, we know how good of a team we are, and we know at times we've had lapses, but we came in and we knew we were going to win the game, and I feel like that's what really helped us, just being confident. Armando, on Thursday you said Hubert was locked in, had been locked in all week. Was this a different kind of locked in for him than maybe you'd seen before? Yes, and for all of us. I mean, we knew it was at stake with this game. We knew it would be a huge quad one win. I think they're like the number four team in the nation, and I mean, just how they beat us at home, I mean, it's North Carolina and losing a game like that at home, it's something that we all were embarrassed of. And it's something I thought about every day until this game. So I've been fired up. I mean, I've seen all the stuff on social media, people saying this and that about me. And I mean, I just knew I was going to come out here today and kick ass. Hubert, <laughs> what does it mean for you to be able to do this for Hubert, to give him that signature win? And obviously they're trying to do this for him. And at Duke, you guys were able to be the ones who actually did it. I mean, it's just so special just because how we won it and just for him to be able to say that, hey, I beat Coach K before, that was just a huge thing for us. And all year people have doubted him. And, you know, I mean, it's his first year. We all learn and it's a whole new team. And just for him to come out here and just coach such a great game, I mean, I'm just so happy for him and glad. Armando, how much satisfying, how much more satisfying is it to win when there are fans in the stands here versus what last year was? Oh, it was amazing. Just the cannon crazy is going crazy. And then in the second half towards the end, just us shutting them up and just being able to celebrate on that court with everybody here, former players here, it was great. Anybody else from Mondo? We got time. Mondo, what, what do you think this kind of momentum this gives you for the postseason? And, I mean, does this reset your expectations for this team in some ways for the rest of March? Yeah, well, I mean, I would say our expectations never change. I don't know if that's us being delusional or just confident, but, I mean, we always felt like we were a great team, even with everyone was saying. We just knew we had to figure out how to play together. And, I mean, I just don't want to be complacent. I don't want to be too excited because, I mean, we've had big wins and haven't responded in the right way. So, I mean, it's great. I'm going to definitely celebrate tonight. But tomorrow we lock back in. And, I mean, I'm not satisfied. Armando, how bad did you guys need this kind of win? You kind of knew what your potential was, but until now you hadn't shown it. Yeah, we definitely needed this win just because there were so many questions about our team. Like I said, our toughness and people saying we couldn't beat great teams, but us going out there and winning a game like this, and I mean, it's probably a 90% chance that we lose today. And just for us to come in here and get this signature win, I mean, I think it's probably one of the greatest Carolina wins that was not a national championship game. So. Just glad to say I was a part of it. Last one for Mondo. Armando, uh, don't mince any words with this, but it, it, forgive me if this question was already asked, but I, I want to know how good it was for you guys to stick it to not only your rival, but for every single person who said you guys didn't have a chance to win this game. How good does this feel? It was great. I mean, just seeing comments like that has been having us on edge for a long time. And I mean, we really don't speak on it too much. We just kind of want to go out there and just show how good of a team we were. 
And like I said, just all week, I mean, we believed and we knew we could win this game and we went out there and did that. And, I mean, we're a good team, especially when we can, you know, stick together and just play boys. We can do a lot of special things. All right, RJ, jump in there.